Welcome to my channel. This reading is for those of you that have strongly Libra in your chart. Please have in mind that this is a general reading, so the messages that will come through may or may not resonate with you. If you're interested in a personal reading, all the information you need is below in the description box. Libra. Let's see what messages will come through for you in December 2023. For Libra. Libra, please. Libra, December 2023. For Libra. For Libra. Ace of Swords. The moon, something is coming to light. The moon and the ace of swords. Yeah, something is coming to light. Okay. Two more shuffles for Libra one. Libra two. Libra two. And on the bottom of the deck, we have the Queen of Cups. And the Queen of Cups is a water energy. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. Okay. Now. Libra. First card for you is the Two of Swords. The Emperor. Judgment. Two of Wands, Five of Wands, and the Ace of Pentacles. Mm. So something is coming to light. See what I mean? And I have been shuffling. I feel that this will, will end things, will complete things. Whatever is coming to light will complete things. I'm not going to start. I'm going to start clarifying with the Two of Swords. Clarifying the Two of Swords for Libra, please. We find the two of swords for Libra. We have the six of swords. And again, I feel that whatever is coming to light, obviously will give you more clarity, more understanding of things. Yes. There's also a sense of relief here, Libra. There's a sense of relief. I find the two of swords with the six of swords. Two of swords with the six of swords for Libra. We have the chariot. Mm. Let me see. And this is this is this is it, it, it becomes easier for you. Not that it hasn't been easy, but it becomes easier for you to like move forward. Because you have received, or you will receive the clarity that is necessary or is like enough to, for you to move forward, to let go and move forward. Okay. I also, I am also seeing some of you traveling. Or considering traveling. We also have the Ace of Wands. Now the Ace of Wands, we all know it's a new beginning. It's a passionate, exciting new beginning that will put a, a smile on your face. After, uh, after a time of, 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 of distress. 
a time of, of sorrow. You went through something, Libra, that was painful, but it all happened so that you, 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 so that you will get where you are going. I really hope this is making sense, Libra. Yes, it all happened definitely 100% sure about that for, for a reason. Look where you were with the Three of Swords energy and where you are heading towards the Ten of Cups. So whatever, again, whatever happened, happened for you. Happened for you, not to you. You understand what I mean? Reframe. Reframe. It's happening for me, not to me. Okay? And this could be also the realization, the Ace of Swords energy. Aha! You know, aha! <laughs> <clears throat> now, it's very interesting because through this, when you were in this time, when you were going through this Three of Swords energy, you were manifesting yourself out of it. You were all... Mm, what did I say now? Interesting. So this Three of Swords gave you that boost, that, that boost. Wow. A Three of Swords. The Three of Swords gave you that boost, that energy to break through. And this is just telling me that you love yourself, Libra, or you learned through this Three of Swords energy to love yourself. So you have, you have been manifesting yourself out of this energy, and you have been manifesting this energy to come, the Ten of Cups. Clarifying, mm. please, victory. Uh -huh. Six of Wands, this is your victory. I mean, hello, it does need a lot of strength and awareness, and self-awareness. To find, please, the Emperor. To find the Emperor for Libra. The star is a healing energy. Very healing. Very, very healing. And we also have the sun. And I did say it. I'm going to say it again. Something will happen that will put a smile on your face. Okay, and it could be that. What? That you are just starting to realize that you're getting out of this three of swords energy. You view life, you view life, you view yourself in a totally different manner. And you're viewing things and yourself and your situation from a different perspective. You're flying against Emperor for Libra. Who is this emperor for Libra? Who is this emperor for Libra? Okay. So this is someone that I feel you have been waiting for. Um, maybe this emperor has not shown yet in your life. It could be. But he, yes, we'll see. Three of Wands is waiting. Waiting. Waiting for the Four of Wands. I am waiting for your wish to come true, true your desire to, to connect with a, an individual that embodies the emperor qualities. Yes? Now this emperor could be someone that you already know, or this is someone that you are waiting for to come in. You're waiting and hoping and wishing for this person to come in, okay? Someone that matches your energy, that suits, matches your energy. Okay. I feel that you have been through, okay. Okay. So in the past, Libra, you were dealing with an emperor. But things were not flowing smoothly between the two of you. Now, the emperor is a masculine energy. It's, 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 it's a boss, it's a husband, it's a father. 
is a masculine figure that somehow, some way has authority over you. Uh huh. Okay. And I'm also seeing here that, uh, and again, this is not for all of you, but I do see an emperor here that is really, really missing you. And again, this is for some of you. We have the Knight of Cups. The King of Cups, Temperance, and the Knight of Cups, and the Knight of Pentacles. Libra. Purifying, please, judgment. Purifying judgment. Four of Swords. Healing. There's a lot of healing that is taking place here. A lot of healing energy. Yes? Let me see how you're healing this Three of Swords. Manifesting yourself, manifesting yourself out of this. Look at you. You're very real. You're, you're more powerful than you realize, Libra. Yeah. You find four of swords. You find four of swords. Three of weapons. <laughs> it does require a lot of strength. That you are stronger than you realize. Or maybe this is also something that you are realizing. That you are powerful, you are strong. You have come a long way, Libra. Now focusing in what, or looking forward, better say looking forward to what the future holds for you. Queen of Wands. Messages, information, communication from could be from a fire sign, a Leo Sagittarius, Aries. I did I say that that something is coming to light? Did I say that to you, Libra? I think I did. Again, this person is 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 expressing, communicating, expressing. Shoot. Uh, yeah, it could be you. It could be you. This is your energy, Libra. Fair, fairness. This is also, also like, this is also a karmic, a karmic energy. Yeah, it is. This, 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 this three of swords, um, because you're hurt here, the person that hurt you or the people that hurt you, I don't know, and it's going to be different for each and every one of you. It's like, There was a lack here. There was a lack, a lack of understanding, a lack of compassion. There was a lack. There was there's a, yes, there's an energy of lack here that that caused that, that caused the pain. <sighs> Libra, I, I I feel that there's going to be a conversation here with the King and the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Wands here. There's going to be a, a form of, of, of communication. Mm. Yeah, that will clear up things. 
this is going to clear up things it's going to, to clear up things yeah it's going to bring, bring a lot of like uh, clarity can we find please the five of wands because the five of wands is a misunderstanding the five of wands is a fight like literally a fight And it could be between you and, and other people. It doesn't have to be with you and, and, and between two people. You understand what I mean? It could be like, yeah. Oof, the tower. For Libra. Wow. And we have the King of Swords. There is no room. There is no room or space for, for gaslighting, trickery. Uh, lies, there is no room for that. Uh, I generally feel that everything is coming to light and it doesn't have to be in a romantic connection, in a friendship, it could be in your workspace, like your work environment. Again, something is coming to light that will bring back balance. Will bring balance, we have the scales here, okay? find the ace of pentacles to find the ace of pentacles for libra the ace of pentacles for libra we have the four of wands the ace of pentacles and the four of wands is uh, stability strong foundations stability oh my goodness ten of pentacles and you definitely deserve all this like um, positive energy you deserve this positive energy to come towards you because here the, the scales were not balanced uh, Libra someone did you wrong here seven of swords someone wasn't fair someone wasn't fair or was, was not speaking their truth or was not saying the whole truth I don't know what's going on here but uh, You know, you see, because they, 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 this brought a lot of confusion in your life, or it brought, it brought confusion, it brought, come on, it brought the Three of Swords. But look how this is changing to the Three of Cups. You see, how can I show you now? Like, whatever is coming into light, whatever this is, because the moon is what we don't see, what we don't know. So whatever is coming into light... is bringing a lot of joy here and is it does put a smile on your face it also feels like a like a, a relief this is also something that belongs to you that is coming back to you <coughs> And it could be, I feel that this uh, is, is, is a, something of a, um, it could be money, it could be a home, it could be money, it could be, it could be simple, just like, it could be energy, 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 your energy. Uh, could, yeah, exactly, it could also be like your, your peace, peace of mind. Huh? Peace of mind. Can find please this before uh, I move on? We're going to find the Ace of Pentacles, the Four of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles for Libra. The Ace of Pentacles, the Four of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles. Libra, uh, again, for, for some of you, this, uh, this uh, unfairness took place in your work environment. You're going to be rewarded here. You're going to be rewarded. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We have the King of Pentacles here. And the King of Pentacles is the King of the 3D reality. Is holding a pentacle. And you have a lot of pentacles here. I don't know if, I, as I said, I feel that something is being returned to you. Or something that uh, was meant for you, never came to you, but now it's coming in. 
and it's going to definitely put a, a smile on your face. Definitely. So, <laughs> the Three of Swords becomes the Three of Cups. You see the difference? There's sorrow, sadness, and there, there's joy and happiness. Powerful reading for Libra. Now let's see what is your uh, message advice from Spirit for December 2023 for Libra. Message advice for Libra, December 2023. Yeah. Yes. Wish. When we stand at the edge of the wishing well, we throw coins into the well with the hope that something will change in our life. Instead of wishing, have the courage to dive into the wishing well. Delve into, delve, deals, delve, into your depths and you will find the richness of your soul. As you are immersed, immersed in your splendor, all is transformed. Yeah, all is transformed from the Three of Swords to the Three of Cups. Libra, this is what I got for you. Take care. Bye. Bye-bye.